So, Sony has finally revealed the PS5 controller. It's called the PS5 DualSense controller, aka the Xbox DualSense. So, um, yeah, the design looks good, looks solid. I mean, it's a two-tone color, and it looks like one of the previous PS4's special editions that had two-tone, like the white and black, um, which I'm assuming the controller will look exactly like the console. So the console will be a two-tone color design, I'm sure. Um, I don't know why everybody's hating on it for, because if you hated Xbox One controller and you're praising this, you're a hypocrite. If you love the Xbox One controller, but you hate this, you're a hypocrite. Just want to get that clarified there. Um, yeah, hip dick feedback and adaptive triggers, which is something that Xbox gamers already been using already. I mean, hey, we've been using this since 2013 right now, right? With this feature, they will have adaptive triggers, which again, it'll make you feel and bring the game to life as well as with you playing with a bow and arrow, feel like you can shoot it and hold the arrow longer. Again, if you played on Xbox One with Tomb Raider, this is nothing new at all. But I'm glad that Sony incorporated this feature because this is a really good feature. I think everybody should have this in their controller. Rechargeable battery. We don't know what kind of battery they're gonna use. I heard it's gonna have long battery life. I'll believe it when I see it. USB-C port. So no more of the micro USB. That's a bummer for a lot of people who don't have a USB-C port, but hey, if you guys have iPhones or any type of gadgets that has USB-C, then I'm sure you're fine with that. Built-in microphone function, useless. I'm just gonna call out the, like, it's useless, okay? A built-in mic feature to communicate with friends, but Sony still recommends you use a headset. See, here's the thing here. They know, Sony even knows that a built-in microphone in the controller is stupid that's why they recommend you guys to use a headset okay now i don't see the point of having a built-in microphone because you're going to hear nothing but button mashing who don't hear this every day you talking to your friends all you hear is this that's all you're going to hear putting a microphone on the controller is stupid it's a gimmick it's useless sony knows it that's why they recommend you guys to use a headset obviously a create button which would be like a share button like the share factory similar to what the ps4 used to do where you can probably record share clips live stream etc pretty good now all this stuff right here is pretty good it's a solid controller it looks like it's going to feel like the xbox one or have a great a uh, better grip um the design is not bad i mean it's not all that but it's not bad i look at this as this controller itself could be marketable now i see the light bar has been removed thank goodness um the light bar feature is kind of it was useless another gimmick that was useless and you move it to the front of the controller now which is pretty cool as you can see on the two sides they got two buttons right here which is i guess like a menu guide and the other one is the share button or the create button if you will but off the back this controller looks fire i mean i have no problems with it i would be nice if they came with a black feature like a black color scheme um but hey it is what it is but i like it i i don't see no problems with it, it looks pretty cool now my only concerns with this is the battery life they said it's gonna have a long battery life but again i'll believe it when i see it as the feel of it because it looks similar to xbox one controller so i could assume that it will feel similar to it which is still good because i like the way the xbox one feel so yeah solid controller man so for all you sony fanboys or sony fans whatever y'all talking about y'all hating on the controller y'all are crazy this is a good looking controller and all you xbox fanboys who love the xbox controller but hate the ps5 controller you guys are hypocrites for all you sony fans that was trashing the xbox one controller saying how garbage it looks but you're praising this you guys are hypocrites ah uh, another day in the gaming community don't you think anyways let me know what you guys think about the ps5 dual sense controller let me know what you guys think in the comments below make sure you guys like comment subscribe it's your boy tizane i'm out of here peace